did you come from? You teleported. I saw that. That person isn't real. They are not real. I've played Tears of the Kingdom for over 150 hours, and these are the funniest things that have happened. Bet you can't watch without laughing. So if you're not a fan of the words, peak fiction, goat, raw, fire, click off of the video. Put those grippers away! Ancient, an ancient arrow, I got my first ancient arrow, guys! An ancient arowana. Are those Yeezys? Looking good. Actually, I don't think anybody cares about Yeezys anymore. Not after, uh... The things Kanye was saying. Hi, I am Kanye West, and I think Zelda games are bad. What do you call a cold Rito? A Rito that is cold. A burr Rito. A burrito. Let me see that pura pad. My PP. Yes, you can see my PP. My pura pad. Might as well uh, do a save job, which everybody knows is my second favorite type of job. I'll let you guys figure out the first one. Because we're going straight to Gaddin! Uh, I don't, am I not, I'm not gonna make it. You guys think if I light both of these uh, things on fire, something will happen? <laughs> what? No way! What did that do? <gasps> A secret chest? My Zelda intuition is too good. Wow, this place looks so cool! <laughs> what is... what is that? Oh! What if I played a horror game? Are those dungeon master do? Oh, where? No, 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 no. Let go, let go. Oh, oh. Listen, listen, listen. Don't touch me. Stop. Don't touch me there. That is my private square. Uh, oh, oh. I love the planes. Oh, no. They seem about a bit, uh, plain to me. I real feel chasm. Chasm? Well, I, I'm confused. Is that not how you pronounce chasm? Oh, Noah Odd's calling me out? I think it's a British thing. Is it a British thing, Odd? I bet I bet you I bet British people pronounce chasm differently than Americans. Let's find out. How do you pronounce chasm? That's pronounced chasm. Never mind! I'm just dumb. Wait, we're at the, uh, what's that? Rock bottom from SpongeBob. And then they all talk like, we pff, have to pff, get pff, out of here. Pff, can I find the bus? Pff, pff, pff. Oh, pff, why didn't you say so? Deep firefly. Deep pff, firefly, pff, a multi wing insect pff, that lives pff, in the depths pff, is extracted pff, luminescent elements that can be pff, pff, cooked into an elixir, pff, which will add a faint. Pff, Blow to anyone who consumes it. <laughs> hey, Gliok, um, I got a snack for you, uh, if you... Oh! If you eat this, man, and just roast it up in your fire, I'm sure it'll taste delicious. Just take it. Ah, uh, it's not me, the, the Korok. If you eat this, I promise, like, just... It, it, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do to, uh... Perry! <laughs> Do we have an infinite log supply? Infinite log lich. Wait for it, now we just look away, and we look back, no? Aha! Whoa! <laughs> what? <laughs> it's back! How does it do it? Can I watch this thing return? Let's see. Don't keep... We gotta watch. It... Oh! What in the world? <laughs> You might be wondering how I got here. A fine question. To explain, I must tell you about the blood moon. Oh yeah, I've seen a couple of those. Yeah, yeah. That's that thing that women have, right? The whole sky turns crimson. And then, defeated monsters appear again. There you have it. The blood moon. It happens only once a month. Life is a highway. I won't ride it all night long. What the heck are you? It's a gay chicken. Just in time for Pride Month. Look at all those chickens. 
All right, what the heck is this place? It looks special. It's etched with ancient Hyrulean text. You cannot read it. The game just called me illiterate. Maybe we ask her if, if she can teach us how to speak a new language. I gotta take du Duolingo classes. The world's biggest stick. You guys think Link is compensating for something? It doesn't do that much. Oh, okay, never mind. I take that back. They killed him. Holy crap, never mind. This might be the best weapon in the game. Screw Bookshelf Bobby. He got replaced by Big Stick Steve. Fear the long stick. The choo-choo doesn't know what to do about the long stick. How about this? How are you guys gonna get around, huh? What are you gonna do? You can't even get me now. They can't get past the stick. Okay, this thing is kind of crazy, but if it had more range, or not range, it has plenty of range. If it had more girth to it, you know, that's what they say. It's not about the length, it's about the girth. I can see that now. What in the world? Walking around full cheeks out. I wouldn't stand, they're standing in the splash zone right now. Like, if this guy accidentally farts and lets one out, they're all gonna smell it. Uh, but sus! Why is everything sus? Oh. Oh, everything reminds me of him. Can you guys believe that Dream got so hurt from my YouTube video I made about him? He got so hurt from that video that he decided to put the mask back on. He put his mask back on maybe two months after I made that video. Coincidence? I think not. I guess you could say that this is the coolest shield in the game. <laughs> How am I doing the sound effects? With my mouth. I'm gonna make the vine boom sound effect. Are you ready? See that? I'm gonna make the best beetle impression you've ever heard. Thank you! Oh wait, are we gonna run out of battery or something like that? Oh no. I knew I should have gotten a hybrid. The gas prices these days are too high! Where's Elon Musk when you need him? Oh wait, we're fine. Insert that one meme. You guys know that the meme of that dog? And it's like, I know what you are, and the dog looks all judgmental. That's me right now. I'm that dog. But I'm not talking about gay people like that dog. I'm talking about the E-Clan. <laughs> I know what you are. We don't take kindly to your folk around here. Come on, Goggles. Are you even listening to me? You call them Goggles? Oh, Swordsman. Wait, is that her thing? Does she not call people by her names? Does she just call people by nicknames? So she calls me Swordsman and called him Goggles? I don't remember what she called Pura. Mommy? Sus again? Are you sus? I am. Show Joshua the picture you took of the statue. Don't show Joshua the other picture I, I took. The, the, she's a little young to see that one. Oh, you're quite the handsome bow, aren't you? Dude, what in the... We just met. Link gets all the girls. <laughs> like, every single game, every girl is always flirting with Link. Link truly does have unspoken riz. Get it? Because he, he doesn't speak. <laughs> Tears of the Kingdom is just bridge building simulator. More bridges? More break! Oh, hurry, 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 hurry! No! Oh, oh, wait! We saved! 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 Go, go, go! Hurry! No! Uh, uh, okay, hurry, hurry, hurry! Oh, oh my gosh! Hurry, hurry! One HP. I should probably eat food, but if I don't eat food, then this will make it way more intense and dramatic for the for the video. Uh, I'm oh, getting a little wonky, crooked bridge. Why not? It, it doesn't gotta look pretty. It's Pride Month. It doesn't have to be straight. You know, I feel like if I made a straight bridge, that would just be, uh, you know, d distasteful. Like, it was already distasteful enough that I did a straight to Ganon video during Pride Month, you know? I could have gotten canceled for that one. Just, just let them do their job. Just let them do it. We'll let the a a AI, the AI will take over, guys. This is, everyone is scared about AI, you know, stealing our jobs. And look at that. They took my job. They took our job. Your equipment will be returned to you. Thanks. God. Is that you? No. All right, robot friends. Thanks for coming, Robert. Ronaldo. Rowan. R R Raul. Thanks for helping out. Oh, and Randy, too. Uh, you didn't do much, but thanks. He was there for moral support. Vehicular manslaughter. Yeah. I love vehicular manslaughter. Buckle up, buckaroo. We're pulling at Caitlyn Jenner! Oh! Oh! Caitlyn Jenner, she is stunning and brave. Buckle up, buckaroo! You know, Bo used to be this, like, really tame, shy Goron. And now he's a pimp!
What, was he watching too much Andrew Tate or something like that? You have the hiccups, Aiden? Here, I got you. You know what they say, you gotta, you gotta scare the hiccups out of you, okay? Boo! I scare you? <laughs> no, I'm an adult. Real things scare me like taxes and health insurance. <laughs> Dude, look at this. Here is a map of every Korok seed if people want help finding them. Yes, a very useful map. Use recall. Go! Up, 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 up. No, we're going down. Oh, the rocket didn't really help that much. Come on, up, 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 up. I should have put the Korok near the back so we would, so we would be like back heavy and we go upward. I'm, I'm very worried about my, my aircraft disappearing. Come on, don't disappear on me, don't disappear on me, don't disappear on me. You're reaching your friends, Kevin. We're we're getting, we're almost there. We're almost to Hawaii, Kevin. Good, we got plenty of clearance, plenty of clearance, guys. Turn it off, turn it off, T stop it. Okay, we're here, Kevin. We're here. Sayonara, Kevin. <laughs> have fun in Hawaii. Hey, hit him, hit him. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him Nobo. Here, I'll, I'll, I'll bring him to you and you hit him, okay? Work as a team. Hit, get him. What are you doing? Why are you not swinging? Swing at him. Come on. Oh, oh. Oh, there you go. You're a little slow there, you know, Bo. They should have called you, you slow bro. More like it. They say bomb arrow solve everything, but I don't know if bombs are a good idea to use in uh, this situation, but uh, I think they're going to instantly explode. Never mind. They don't in this instantly explode. Probably because these are like the Goron plants, right? <laughs> They do instantly explode! Only somebody with my intellect would understand the uh, the big brain play that is currently happening right in front of their eyes. Like, most people just can't comprehend. They, they see this and they think it's, uh, it's, it's stupid, but it's not. It's actually the, like, smartest thing. Nobody's ever done this before. The beautiful thing about Tears of the Kingdom and Breath of the Wild is the fact that there are multiple ways to complete something. What this also means is that no matter what I do, there's gonna be somebody who did it differently than me, and it's going to tell me that I am doing it wrong. <laughs> mm-hmm. There we go. Bridge building simulator complete. Now, I know the chat is telling me to use recall, but I recall... NOT ASKING! I have the, uh, the biggest Zelda brain known to man. I got it on day one. Now, what we could do here is what I like to call the old tightrope technique. The tightrope technique, it's its its a very advanced technique that only somebody as big of a brain as me could comprehend. Now, you guys may be putting alternate uh, alternate ideas in the chat right now that will be more, uh, maybe more effective, might, one might argue, but uh, it's not as cool as this. Are you guys scared? I'm not. I wouldn't scare though. All we need to do is just destroy this with Yenobo. Speaking of Yenobo... Hey! Uh... You okay? He's in, he's in Goron jail. I'm locked up, they won't let me out. Wanna kick his butt, Goro? Okay, ramp buddy. Wait, what if I just walk out of here? Can I just leave? Can I just... Okay, bye, bye, have fun. You know what, I give up. We don't need to save Zelda, okay? I can live my life without Zelda. We'll move on. We have Pura instead, you know? She can be my new girlfriend. We don't need to save Zelda. Um, what's the worst that could happen? Like, what? Gandor's gonna come back or something? Yeah, right. Like, that would happen. <sighs> <sighs> what's that? The smelly smell. The smelly smell that smells... smelly. Oh, it, get it, get it, I guess. Oh! In the Yoinky Sploinky! I think they spent the past six years actually on uh just making that dance right there. <laughs> Alright, we have now taken over the Bokoblin base. And this is now our garage that we will do all things vehicles with. Here in my garage, just bought this uh new Lamborghini. I think I've noticed something. An issue with my hover bike. Well, one issue is that it runs out of battery fast. <laughs> but the other issue is, it's not going in a straight line. We are turning. So I clearly may have messed up the hover bike. Maybe just a big Beyonce fan. And I just wanted to go to the left. To the left, to the left. 
I was just in crooked because we're clearly not going in a straight line. You know, it's it's no longer Pride Month anymore. We got to be straight now. It's straight season. We're making the ultimate vehicle better than the hover bike. Let's see. Oh, you got some range. Okay. Oh, that is. Oh, you're catching me on fire too. Ah, 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 ah. I'm on fire. I guess you could call this a a hot rod. <laughs> All right, guys. Using weapons to fight, then the weapons break. That is the way of our world, Hyrule. In the olden days, there existed a legendary weapon that could not break. That weapon was... Bookshelf Bobby. Unfortunately, the cruelty of time has taken its toll on him. Now he resides inside the Hyrule Castle Library, living a peaceful life. However, Sometimes I get the strangest feeling like he's calling for me. Oh wait, that's my phone. Actually, the Gliak doesn't even know where I am. Bobby is just a really great way to hide yourself. We might be able to get it close enough to the Gliak at this point where we can just pet him and befriend him. <laughs> We're gonna ride on top of him like a horse. My stamina meter's about to start draining. Then, you know, register you at my stable. Can I get some PP points? Holy shit, his tongue. Wait for it. Oh. Hello? Ah! <laughs> whoa, whoa, what happened? Why, why did Bobby break? When the world needed him most, he vanished. But when the world needed him most, he vanished. Look at our bookmobile. Even better than the Batmobile. Do you need a driver's license or a library card to drive it? <laughs> okay, this is the first time I've actually ever done a Monster Forces. I've never done this before. Oh, okay, we're, uh... Hey guys, just, just, just give me a second. Just gotta, we just gotta recharge. I'm plugging it into my Tesla recharge station. Just, just, it'll be a second. It'll, it'll be, it'll be a second. Just get, give me a moment. Uh, any day now. Mm-hmm. There we go. Okay, my, the fire is a little high up. It's kind of missing. It's going over their heads. Just like my amazing jokes are so good, it goes over some people's heads. I was told that you wield a special sword. One more magnificent than all the- Oh, yeah, you mean my bookshelf bobby sword? It's actually, um, it's over there right now. That's that's definitely the sword you're talking about, right? Not not the master sword? What? Hey, what? What? Hey, he picked up my- No! He's using the power of bookshelf bobby against me! Yeah, I gave you a haircut. How's that? Look at the top of his head! He's bald! Bald! My eyes! All right, now that we have publicly shamed him from being bald, hopefully he leaves us alone. Together as one, till we find ourselves again. One day, I'll come see you. I promise. Me too. One day, I promise. This is the truth of our world. Memories melt in the morning light, and then, a new day begins. Roads stretch out before us, so many paths. Which do you choose? That's up to you. Sometimes, you may run astray. You'll stop, maybe cry in frustration. But you know, that's alright. For the roads, they go on without end. So look up, face forward, toward your chosen horizon, and just walk on. What I've done, I'll face myself. Good eye, mate, and welcome back to the Korok, a down hunter. My name is Mr. Terrible Australian Accent Guy, and today we'll be taking a close look at one of the most strange creatures on the planet the Yiga Clan. To do this, my assistant, Mr. Nice Guy, will sneak into the base and join their ranks because I'm too busy fighting a roo. 
Show them how it's done, Mr. Noise Guy. Now that, uh, we are the Yi Clan's favorite thing in the world, they'll have to let us join the Yi Clan now. Master Koga of the Yi Clan. This is, this is what we're doing right here. You gotta go, Master Koga. I mean, Happy Sammer, my bad. How do you get Master Koga mixed with Happy Sammer? Because I just, I was, I had Master Koga on my mind. To become a part of the Yi Clan, you must think like a Yi Clan member. And what do Yi Clan members always think of? Master Koga. And bananas. Oh, fire keys? You know, I could fight you guys, but instead I think I'll make like a banana and split. Ah, get out of here. Can you eat puff shrooms? I've never tried this before. Dude, look at them. Oh! Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh, God. Ah, oh, those are Snoop Dogg's favorite type of mushroom right there. The Puff Puff Pass Shroom. All this turnover has led to a supply shortage in the bases. Do you know how hard it is to find a banana? Um... Not very hard. <laughs> what? <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm now a frozen banana, ready for a Sunday. Bro, I was, I was- <laughs> What?! I just spawned! You know, you're looking awful lot like Link. Uh... No? Wait a second. Is that? No way. Chat, they put your mom in this game? How uh, do y'all remember how many rupees you have? They only care about the money. I ain't about the money. I'm about how many, um, simmered fruits in your inventory do you have, huh? How many simmered fruits do you have in your inventory, huh? As many as me? Doubt it. That's, that's, the, that's the real currency. Who, who cares about how many rupees you have? It's all about the simmered fruits. Do I wear the hat because I'm bald? Uh, yeah. I'm bald. Bald! 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 bald. <laughs> he's wearing a hat because in he's embarrassed about being ginger. I don't know how to say this, guys, but, uh... I'm ginger. And I'm not proud of it. I've been closeted ginger my whole life. Always telling myself that I am not ginger. I'm blonde, actually. Is what I always told myself to make myself feel better. But, uh... It's true, guys. It's true. I know, you guys might unsub now. Now that you guys know I'm a ginger. I, I, it's completely understandable if you unsub. Anti-ginger prejudice. Yeah, and, and I'm sorry. If, if you guys are ginger watching my videos right now, no no mean to offend. I, I am a, actually an ally for the gingers. I'm a ginger ally. When National Kick a Ginger Day comes, I will have your back. The gingers have, are the now the number one, like, most most hated group in America. You guys thought gay people had a bad, uh, they ain't got nothing on gingers, you know? You wanna try fighting the Lionel? Here we go, guys. My nephew is about to try fighting the Lionel. Let's see how it goes. I won't tell you how to play. You just figure it out on your own. Good luck. <sighs> All right, you got it. You can do it. Oh, whoa, what? You can do that? What did he, he just, he, what? He just mounted him. Mid attack! How did he do that? This was this. I didn't even know he could do that. Okay, he's hitting you. Yeah, but uh, oh, you hit him! You hit him! Oh my gosh, he's actually cracked. Oh, never mind. He died. Today, my wife left me in charge of the kid, so I'm taking him to the water park. And by me, I mean Link. And by wife, I mean Zelda. And by kid, I mean a Korok. And by water park, I mean water temple. Today I'm taking a Korok to the water temple in Tears of the Kingdom. Got it? Good. Oh jeez! Hey, don't worry if he dies, guys. The blood moon will just revive him. I got you. Don't worry. This, this will clean you up real good. Uh, may maybe another? It's not working, Nova. What do I do? Help. I've got it, Goro! Wasn't, uh, wasn't Sidon down there? Did we just pass Sidon? Bye! Bye! <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what? 
Wait, do you have business elsewhere? If so, then I shall head back until the right moment is upon us. Wait, I'm saying I can't leave this place. I shall wait your turn, my friend. <laughs> what? Okay. I'm tied on. I'm coming back. Where did he go? Um. Sidon? Where did he go? He's gone now. He left. <laughs> oh, no. What? You weren't there. You were not there. I just saw. You were not there. What? Are you okay, Carl? <laughs> oh, jeez. You're getting waterboarded. I, I, help. I'm calling Child Protective Services. No. No, don't do that, please. Carl, I'm sorry. Listen, there was a mistake. Don't call it Child Protective Services. I hate you, Dad. Ugh. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. What if we use the Puff Shroom? This is a brand new thing they added to this game. We can make ourselves a... <laughs> My Puff Shroom still went off. That's some seriously ninja moves. We threw down a smoke screen and teleported it out of there. Uh-uh. Ah! Wait, why are we caring about thunder? We have the lightning helm on, right? Give me your worst! Do it! I'm talking to you, Zeus! Man, you better not taunt me! Take this! Oh. That's what I thought! A boat or... A boat or what? Finish your sentence. Boat or... Uh, come on, spit it out. Maybe we'll find Davy Jones' locker. That's got to be the best part I've ever seen. If your cat hears my voice, he comes running over. Your cat enjoys my content too. I'm actually fluent in Catanese. Um, wait a second. Isn't isn't Catanese is that an actual language or no? Meow, 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 meow. There we go. I just told your cat to thank you for watching my videos. Hold on, I need to look. The Catanese. This is why does it sound real? Cantonese? Is Cantonese the actual thing? The language within the Chinese branch of the Sino-Tibetan languages originating from the city of Guangzhou and its surrounding Pearl River Delta. Yeah, it's I'm deaf. It's... Prestige variety of okay, Chinese, that's not... That's, you can shut up. You can shut up now! You stop! If Cantonese exists, what about Cantonese? Huh? Why are they so negative? Why are they saying we can't anise? Well, what about we can anise? You know what I'm saying? Dude, your name is Dire Wolf. Do you guys know what a dire wolf is, guys? It's like a wolf, but it's dire. Just like the dire bears. Do you guys know what dire bears are? They're like bears, but they're dire. Oh, don't even get me started on dire lions. Do you guys know what dire lions are? They're like lions, but they're dire. Don't need to worry about me. I can manage a simple landing. All right, are you sure? Hold on, guys. <laughs> Do I just get this thing a little wet? It, but we're falling. <laughs> I'm falling! Oh! You don't look very concerned at all. We're just falling to our death. I killed Impa, dude. She left. She lived to be like a hundred years old or something. She's ancient, and I killed her. We are on a giant Nintendo Switch right now. If I was something of importance, where would I be? On the Joy Cons, probably. Something giving me Joy-Con drift. Is this something important? Why should it just be a Korok? <laughs> You're the reason why I have Joy-Con drift. I have Koroks in my Joy-Cons. Oh. Ow. Like, I don't know. It makes sense to me that would be like right here in this big flat spot. Hold on. Mm. I did. I did see that correctly. You're telling me that I literally landed right here on this... Oh. That is some baloney. Hey, wait, is that Sidon? I... I've been noticing, my guy. Um, you look kind of sad. Are you okay, dude? Because, uh, I don't know, how, how do I put this? You're looking a little blue. All right, if this is a Korok, you have to all subscribe to me on the YouTubes. Uh-oh. Look who has to subscribe. I have nothing to say to those not of the Yiga. Oh, <laughs> well, luckily for me, I do have my, uh, my Yiga license, actually. Uh, so right here? 
It's actually invisible because uh, it's that secretive. Wait, shouldn't he be like, what? <laughs> I just pulled out my one of a kind Pura pad and he doesn't suspect me to be Link. Link's just whipping out his PP over here. No repercussions. Evo wandered in here. What? Did you say Evo? Uh. Nothing to worry about. The bow is very short. <laughs> I can't even reach the peepholes in this door. I'm being short shamed. We're in the middle of Short King Summer right now. Actually, it's gonna be about to be Short King Fall. So you better respect me. That aside, and even on his tiptoes, it will be. He's, she's still talking crap about my height. Hope the water's current carries my letters far and wide. Bro, she is just. How many letters does she make? She's throwing so many in there. Like, how? Why do you need so many? How many are in there? We have one. Let's count. Two. Ten. We're gonna be here all day, guys. This, this is gonna be the entire the entire stream is gonna be this. Dude, she is the sole source of pollution in this world. <laughs> in Hyrule. She's just <laughs> destroying the environment. Wait, why is there there's another dude here? I thought Vo weren't allowed in here, huh? What's what's this guy doing? Is that is that your boyfriend in there? No, <laughs> oh, he's in jail. Oh, never mind. The only way to into jail is to break our rules. How do I break the rules? Like this? Do I do this? Do I smack you with a box? We just blow everybody up! Freeze! Okay. I'm sorry. It was just a prank, guys. Just a prank. That's not even the cool way to go to jail, forehead. <laughs> At least I didn't take the average Minecraft YouTuber way to go to jail. What is the cool way to go to jail? I don't think going to jail is very cool. I think this is a... Uh, you should not be saying that there is a cool way to go to jail. Jail is bad, okay? Sexually harass the Gerudo? Oh, Jesus. You, you called? called? Um, not in front of the children, Link. Let's go somewhere else. I was told if I take my clothes off, I get arrested inside of here. Is this true? I really am about to end up like a Minecraft YouTuber now. Oh. <laughs> hey, Bo, you can't just walk around like that. Not in front of the children, Link. There's one right behind you. Oh, no, Link. <laughs> You pulled an EDP45. That should wake up the mechanism in the center. Let's go, Link. Let's go, Link. Crumpets and tea with the queen. Hit the laser close to the green door. I'm not gonna touch the laser. I'm not dumb. You guys are trying to troll me. I asked your advice and you said to everybody says to touch the lasers and they're trying to get me to take damage. That's, this is not the answer. <laughs> I'm not stupid, unless maybe you guys are telling the truth and I do have to touch the laser for some godforsaken reason. And if I do have to touch the laser, then what kind of game design is that? Lasers in Zelda games typically hurt. You're not, tr you're not troll. Oh my gosh. You understand I have to have trust issues right now because I don't want to take any damage. So of course I'm not going to touch the lasers because what do lasers do? They damage you. Whose bright idea was to make a shrine where lasers don't damage you? Okay, this I don't feel stupid for this one at all. This is just a poorly designed shrine. What the heck was that? You really, uh, blow me away. Oh. That did not get me the height I expected. How do I get more height off of that? Use rubies? You guys said rubies. Do I have, even have a ruby? Any, oh, there we go. Oh, there's no way I can take damage here. Thanks, Raru. Appreciate ya. Not unless I misstep and I just fall off the side of the stairs. Link trips on his stair and just falls down. Insert that Peter Griffin falling down stairs clip here. Okay, this shrine is giving me major portal vibes. I don't know if you guys have ever played Portal before. If you haven't, what's wrong with you? There are puzzles in that game. Back in my day, we had to go through a whole bunch of guardians in order to get to the Hyrule Castle. Kids these days playing Tears of the Kingdom don't even know what a guardian is. There are these crazy robotic octopus that shoot lasers out of their eyeballs. Yeah, sure thing, Grandpa. Sure thing, guardians. Grandpa's off his meds. What do we get? Nobody knows.
This is our hot sauce of the day. Take a look at it. It's got uh, the devil on it. It says hot sauce from hell. It's got to be hot. It says the world's hottest hot sauce right here. And it also says beyond hot. So it's got to be hot, okay? You can't complain about it not being hot this time like last time. How much do I have to do? Okay, this is like almost a full spoonful. You see this? See it? Yeah, see it? Are you seeing it now, Mr. Krabs? <laughs> I'm gonna die. I'm gonna probably start crying. I might. My eyes are gonna start tearing up. <coughs> Spoon is clean. I got it all in there, guys. Oh! Oh my god. <coughs> we'll go a minute. No drinking water. <sighs> this is definitely more spicy than the last one. Fine, let's play a little bit of... Here's the kingdom. Without drinking water. <laughs> no water yet. Is it really that bad? Dude, this is some spicy hot sauce. What do you think? Did you see the packaging? It says hot sauce from hell. Beyond hot. World's hottest hot sauce. Let's collect all this donut. And then I'll drink some water. They're back down. Never what? Never give up. I hear my dad yelling at football. Yo, oh, my dad does that too. This is, just, is this just like a thing everybody goes through at one point? See, if I was a father, I wouldn't be yelling about football. You know what I'd be yelling about? I'd be watching Super Smash Brothers tournaments. <laughs> and I'd be yelling. <laughs> Mom, dad's raging at his video games again. I am going to beat the strongest enemy in Tears of the Kingdom. Just watch. We did it! Okay, do you think they were inspired by Xenoblade 3? Or do you think Xenoblade 3 was inspired by Tears of the Kingdom? Because there's literally the same type of like moving sand. I just thought about that in, in Xenoblade 3. I mean, Monolith Soft did work on both of these games. Not to mention the fact that these guys follow me around everywhere it makes me feel like I'm playing a Xenoblade game too. Be like, ah, my party members are following me. No, no. I'm getting sucked! I'm getting stuck down! Oh, great. Yes, yeah, sand is a Xenoblade reference. Only Xenoblade has had sand in, in their games before. No other game. Hold on. No way! <laughs> wow, okay, I'm sorry. Listen, man, like I said, sand is a Xenoblade reference, but there was literally... There was these sand pits just like this, where there was flowing sand that led into a hole, and if you went down into the hole, it would lead you into a cave. Does it do the same thing in Tears of the Kingdom? Bro, wait, what about Sidon? Will you protect me from the heat? I mean, at least your shield will protect me. That's what I could have done to survive that Moduga attack. Come back! Ah! <laughs> hey. <laughs> what? Did he just, did he, was he giving me the thumbs up there? I could have sworn he was looking at me and just going, nice dude, nice. I don't care about gloom hands anymore. I want some of them gloom toes. Sir, have you ever regretted attaching something to your weapon or shield? Yeah. I regret attaching my ex-wife to my life. Can you get rid of her? Oh, sorry. Though I do understand. I know you're worried about Madison moving. Ah, a customer. You just now noticed me standing directly in between you guys, huh? Uh, am I that short? You don't just look down a little bit. You just, I'm that short. I'm not even noticeable. There's this amazing language called Garuda. I want to teach every son. <laughs> every son. Get it? Because e everybody's name ends with son, son here. You would think they wouldn't have daughters. No daughters would be allowed in this place because all they care about is sons. So I've made it my miss son. <laughs> my, my miss son. I'm about to give a less. <laughs> Alright, sir. Sir, here. This is your alarm clock. Wake up, it's 4.35 p.m. <laughs> Wake up, your house is on fire. There's smoke everywhere. What do these do? I get, I, I, I've gotten a couple of these. The remnants of former sages resolve. You gather four of them and offer them to a goddess statue. You can deepen your connection with the sages? What? I can deepen my connection with Sidon? Whoa. Are me and Sidon about to get? Extra personal. 
I'm inside of them. Maybe that's a little too personal, Sidon. The path to dream home ownership. Yes. I'll never be able to afford a house in real life, but at least I can have one in the video game. Oh, this hits too close to home, guys. I can't afford a house in real life or in fiction. Oh wait, we're getting close with all those monsters around. Hmm? Why do I get the feeling we're being watched? Um, maybe if you averted your gaze a little bit downward and then you would see me. I know I'm short and all, but come on, I'm still here. Yeah, I'm Jeruk, I mean, you know both. I still call you the wrong name. Jeruk's my father. Please. Call me an oboe. It's nice having a, a whole squad to fight enemies for me. No longer do I fight alone. Are you seriously playing Tears of the Kingdom by yourself? Nah, I'm with my no! Am I playing Katamari right now? <laughs> That's what it feels like. I'm just bundling up a whole bunch of random objects and putting them in a giant pile and going to be pushing them around. I played that game t this year and it's a banger. Caterpillar Democracy, my favorite video game. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm playing Katamari in Tears of the Kingdom. All that's missing is this ba banger soundtrack, but I'll make sure to edit it into my YouTube video. You have Xenoblade 4. Whoa. Oh yeah? Well, I have Xenoblade 10. Xenoblade 10. As you can see, the X is the Roman numeral for 10. A Wii U game from the future. Yeah, that's in the future when Nintendo releases the Wii U again. In the future, Nintendo will eventually realize that the Wii U is the best console that they ever made, and they'll release the Wii U again because they realize that there's no way for them to one up the Wii U. We can go inside of our shed now? We couldn't do that in Breath of the Wild? Wow. This is what the 10 extra bucks for Tears of the Kingdom was, guys. That's what it was. It's all worth it now. Oh! An old, worn, simple hairband. Okay. Then, um, explain the one I'm already wearing right now. There's a magic word I was waiting for. You're a lifesaver. No, no, I'm not. I'm not a lifesaver. I'm not a lifesaver. You're a lifesaver. Oh, yeah, baby. Cheese. Is that what we're doing? We're going to revitalize Ateno with cheese? We've just become Wisconsin. Are you sweating, Link? Do you get that nervous when you talk to women? I get it, Link. I'm the same way. Built for rails. Built for rails sounds like my ex-wife. <laughs> Sorry. Can I just keep doing this? This works. This works surprisingly well. This works very well. This works incredibly well! <laughs> That's how you do it. Really? If I fall now? Okay. We're good. <laughs> hey! That was 100% easier <laughs> than just building something. <laughs> Insert the snowboarding music from Sonic Adventure here. Let's do this! Oh, the world's biggest snowboard ramp. <laughs> Dude, imagine somebody doing this in real life. This would be like, wait, actually somebody did kind of jump out of the sky. Remember that Red Bull thing? I jumped over it! <laughs> Jump again! Oh! Oh, this is like that mini game from Mario Party! Oh. Jump rope! Oh, my shield! Jump rope! <laughs> no way am I playing jump rope with God Chunk right now. Let me know in the chat what is a shrine you guys really struggled with? And I'll go do it right now. So then I can make fun of you for being like, ha, you guys actually struggle with this? Could it be me? Me when I see your mom? <laughs> oh, were you guys getting drunk on some wine in here? They were drinking. Well, what kind of wine were they drinking? Hmm. Yes. Hold on. I clearly don't have my glasses on, so I can't read this right now. All right, let me try that again now that I have my glasses on. Hmm. Must be the wrong prescription. Takis? No, not Gatakis. I don't need a reminder about Takis. Where is the owl? The big owl dude from Breath of the Wild. Is he dead? Impa's still alive? 
She's like ancient, but the owl, he's gone? Maybe he just flew away. He's, he's now living peacefully in the giant bird nest in the sky. I will never believe he's dead. <laughs> are, are you reading that sign there, Yunobo? You good? What, what does it say, Yunobo? What does it say? She was just standing there, just staring at the sign. Zebra Mountain Clay Path, Goro! Chill streams, bro. I didn't know you were chill like that. Oh my gosh, is that Dwayne The Rock Johnson? What? The what? 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 Did, did, did Yunobo hit? Hold on. Ah, oh, Yunobo! <laughs> I take everything good I said about you back. All right, so we're looking for a lone tree, lone cedar tree. Show me pictures of cedar trees. It looks like we have a lot of different types of cedar trees, unfortunately. So what kind of type of cedar tree you're just saying? A lone cedar tree? What's good? There's like, there's Diodar cedar, Northern white cedar, Eastern white cedar, Western red cedar, Spanish cedar. What it speak, the tree speaks Spanish? You should go with him and investigate the cloud. You say the princess soared into. We think it's likely that the blizzard is coming from inside that cloud after all. What? <laughs> Wait. We think it's likely that the blizzard is coming from inside the cloud. Isn't that how blizzards work? What? Snow coming from a cloud? Since when? Hi, my name is Mr. Nice Guy, and I'm addicted to the hover bike. It's become a serious problem. My wife constantly complains about it. She says it's not normal to take a hover bike into the bed when we go to sleep. I, I thought it was completely normal. It gets hot at night. I need some wind. Apparently, it wasn't appropriate to bring a hover bike to my grandpa's funeral. I was a very sad time in my life and I needed a friend there and my hover bike's always there for me. And everybody says I apparently have some sort of problem, okay? I'm, I'm trying to get over it. I don't know, know what the big issue is. I can stop at any time, I promise. I've been hover biking for three years now. Uh, it has been a serious detriment to my uh, health. The doctor says I only have one more month to live. <laughs> If I continue to hover bike. Thankfully, I am now one week sober of hover bike, and my condition is improving. This one time, I overdosed on hover bike, and I had to be sent to the hospital. The doctor said that uh, if I didn't make it there in, t in 15 minutes later, I probably would have died. Break the ice. Just like uh, when you talk to a girl, you know, Bo, you gotta hit her with an icebreaker. <laughs> Dude, you suck. What did you say to her? Hello there, Goro. Jump off, jump off. Okay. Oh, hey. Ah, hey, 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 that's my hover bike. <laughs> I, I, no. It destroyed my hover bike. Just, just got destroyed. No. Oh, how will I survive? My addiction is too strong. <laughs> what the? Yo, chicken little, watch your mouth, dude. You're just a child. This proves it, Link. The blizzard that's been pounding Rito Village is coming from there. Wish my name was Rito Village. Mmm. <laughs> Hold on, I came up. I have a really funny idea. This is wasting my hover bike, but it's for a joke. So I think it's worth it. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Hover bike solves everything, guys. Chulin. That's what British people call uh Tulin. They say Chulin, actually. My favorite Zelda character, Chulin. Isn't that right? Any any British people watching this can confirm? Don't lie. I, I already know. The British people in the chat are about to lie. They're about to be like, we don't say Chulin in it. More lasers, guys. Will they hurt? Oh! This theme slaps harder than a bully. It slaps harder than my abusive ex-wife. <laughs> I forgot about this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh. <laughs> I joined a random person's arena on Smash Bros. And this was the custom stage they had chosen. A any, any day now. There we go. Grab onto Bobby, and then we'll we'll drop it on Zelda. Yeah. 
Oh, jeez, guys. The princess herself has invited little old me over into her bedroom. What you do? Ah, uh, ah! Uh, I got catfish. I didn't know Zelda was a lizard person the entire time. Okay, where's Zelda now? Is it? Uh, I'm going down. Hoo -hoo. You're telling me this bridge survived for thousands of years, and now is the time it decided to break? Really? Ah! Ah! ah I'm getting crushed! Ah! I'm inside of the wall! Ah! What the heck? I just got turned into a Link sandwich. I liked how my ice shield got a chance to shine, but I'm gonna put it away, because I'm always worried about it melting. It doesn't seem like it's melting. But let's say I go downstairs here, and I cook some food. Ah, oh, jeez, dude, it's so big and large. I feel so in charge. My confidence is gonna go through the roof now. I get to impress all the ladies with my giant lawnmower. Faulkner, I feel like every single stream I do, you always ask me to do ASMR at least once. You know what? This is your ASMR right here. Listen to the sound effects. You hear that? Ooh. Now that's satisfying. That, that is ASMR. That gives me the tingles. I'm t totally tingling right now, guys. And I'm not talking about the guy from The Legend of Zelda. I've got a raging tingle right now. Oh yeah, dude, I love the Zelda movie. My favorite part was when Link said, Hyah! 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 He was really spitting when he said that, you know? The writers, when, when they're in the studio, those writers went hard. Insert that gif of that guy writing on a piece of paper and it's like catching on fire. Yes, it is pronounced gif. People be like, oh, so what? The, the creator of the gif said that it's pronounced gif? He doesn't get to control how English works when you name something. But yes, you do. Because why the heck are people named Jeff when their name is spelled G-off? My parents named me Evan. Oh, his name is pronounced Yvonne. All right, that's how you pronounce his name, guys. And my name would be Yvonne, spelled Evan. When you name something, you can, you're just, you're just that guy. The P in JPEG stands for photographic, but I bet you don't say JFEG. I'm gonna tell you a joke. There's these three guys out on a hunting trip. Unfortunately, they're not having much luck. The guys are getting hungry. So one of the guys says, you know what? We need food. I'm going out to get some food right now. So he goes out hunting, looking for food. And he comes back with a deer. And they're like, whoa, dude, how'd you find that deer? We looked everywhere before, what? And he's like, uh, I just found the tracks and I followed it and I found myself a deer. Next guy goes out, okay, I'm gonna get some food. My turn, he goes out there. A little bit later, comes back with a deer. He got some food and they're all impressed. He's like, whoa, dude, how'd you do that? He's like, oh, I just did what the other guy said. I, I found the tracks, followed the tracks, and I found a deer. The next day, third guy goes out. He's like, I'm gonna go get some food, and I'll be back. The third hunter comes back, and he's just absolutely, like, beat up. He's bleeding, he's got broken bones, and the other guys are like, what happened, dude, what happened? And he says, I, I did what you guys said. I found the tracks, I followed them, but then I got hit by a train. That's an awfully hot coffee pot. Will I cut all the grass in this game? Probably not. When do gloom hands ever pay? Good question. I think they're always asking for handouts. Watch and learn. This is how a, a real man does things, all right? Just because I'm shorter than Taru, all right? Doesn't mean I'm less than a man than him. I, I totally don't feel invalidated. My masculinity is not having issues right now, okay? Bomb arrow solve everything! Shut up. Hey, check out this picture. Um... Listen, man, I know he's got hot abs, but his eyes are up here. Yikes, 5,000 rupees in this economy? I saved your life in Breath of the Wild. You could at least just, you know, give me some free armor. In fact, I already bought this armor in Breath of the Wild. 
It belongs to me! Also, she looks like she has had a rough day. This is what working in retail is like. Ah, look, I know I won't help to talk about it, but I'm gonna do it anyway. My grandmother is really sick. I'm sorry about this, but we really need money for grandmother's treatment. Is that why? Oh, now I feel bad. Oh, oh. <laughs> I was making fun of your shop prices, and now I just feel bad about making fun of you. Let's go find her grandma and save her life from the gloom vid 19 that she has. Are you dressed up as OG Link, Greg? Um, nah, I just decided to wear something casual today. This is just my everyday outfit. Nothing, nothing special. Yeah, ha ha! What is that? Sir, what is that between your legs? Put that thing away, Korok. Put it away, there are children here. Sing the Steven Universe theme. Um, I need to remember how the song goes. You've got, your Aiden's probably mad at me for not even remembering. Um, we are the crystal gems. We always save the day. And if you think we can't, then, well, I think you're gay. Oh no, guys, I got bad news. Um. I've got a pee. One pair of pants later. I am back, and I see her say, everyone ask Evan if he washed his hands. No, I just peed all over my hands. They are dripping with pee right now. Everywhere, it's getting on the carpet as we speak. My controller is drenched with pee. Hold on guys, um, there seems to be a little bit of pee left on my finger here, let me just there we go, I just had to clean it off my finger. That's how I wash my hands, by the way. After I, uh, after I get done peeing, I just lick my hands clean. It saves water, guys. It's, it's much more efficient and better for the environment. Aiden, teach Evan healthy tips to stay healthy. I work out, like, almost every day. I'm pretty healthy. Don't make me do it. Don't make me do it! <laughs> Evan is a guy who actually washes in between his butt cheeks in the shower, and that's all I could ask for. All right, Ben, you heard, you heard Aiden. All you gotta do is wash in between your butt cheeks in the shower and you're already more hygienic than 90% of other guys. I have a back shield. Oh, just like in Smash Brothers when you get the back shield item. My favorite item, it always has my back. All right, this is gonna take a while. And there goes my cannon. Go, go, go. Excuse me, no? Uh-oh. Bye! Thanks for coming! It's dinner time! We're having meatloaf, guys! Yeah! Yo, shout-outs to Asian food and Mexican food. They were really- they were cooking out there, even Italians. How can you be racist when other races make such good food, you know? Food solves everything. Simple as that. Let's get this. Talking about eating food and racism, solving racism, as we land the sick stunt. And by land, I mean missed by pixels. Crap! See guys, racism can be solved. All you have to do, let's say uh, somebody's racist towards a certain group of people, just let them eat that group of people's food and they'll be like, whoa, I was all wrong about you guys. <laughs> you guys aren't bad after all. World peace has been solved, guys. Let's go. Right, 360. Did you see that? We put the shield away, put it back out. Oh, that was the best trick we've done yet. But all I wanted in life was to be ballin'. Mr. Nice Guy could never be ballin'. What? He's ballin'? Like that's that's the kind of thing I want to happen. Like people are gonna be like, nah, Mr. Nice Guy, he could never be ballin'. And then they see me ballin'. And I don't mean ballin' as in crying. He's playing basketball. We're launching at a weird angle. I'm gonna splat into that thing. Let's see if I can avoid that from happening. No. Well, uh, for all the people who've been wanting me to sing, I've been singing a lot now, because that's what happens when I start to go crazy. Is your horse okay? Your horse is in half. It is inside of the wood. How does this work? Are you okay, miss? It feels so good to be out in the plains. Does it feel good to be stabbed through with a piece of wood? Hmm. 
I don't know why, but something smells fishy around here. Jesus. You know, before I actually did the stream, I was like, hmm, should I make this stream I gift memberships if I die in the game or if I take damage? I never die. Zero deaths, guys. Do you see this right beneath me here? It clearly says zero deaths. It says 79 deaths, Alex? What? Hold on. I think you're crazy. Look at my pointy hat. Link, be careful with that pointy hat like that. People are gonna think you're joining a clan that you should not be joining. Link is an elf. It does look like an elf hat. Hey, this, that, that actually works for Christmas too. I have the Santa hat. He's my elf. He's even got the pointy ears. Uh, Link, there's no shrine there. Oh, it's invisible. Wow, man, the, uh, the Zonai really, their technology is incredible. All right, let's 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 go inside, guys. Let's go inside. Whoa, guys, this shrine is incredible. What? Ah, 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 no, 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 oh, 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 oh my gosh, guys, I almost took damage, holy crap, oh my god. Oh, dude, this, this shrine is crazy. There's enemies everywhere, dude. Ah, oh my gosh, there's a lionel, what? Why is there a lionel in a shrine? Flourish, got it, oh, okay. Ah, oh, we did it. Oh my gosh, got dude, that shrine was. Oh, oh no, I had, oh, I had this, the, the thing turned off. Oh, you guys couldn't see. Oh, I'm, uh, I beat the shrine, guys, and you totally missed the entire thing. Oh, crap. Dang it. Use the fish to deliver a news broadcast like SpongeBob. Breaking news! This is, wait, what's his name? What is the fish who does the news in SpongeBob's name? The realistic fish head, also known as Mr. Fish, Johnny, T. McTrout, and Elaine, is a tuna who works as an announcer and anchorman in Bikini Bottom. Why you got so many names? Breaking news! Sidon the Salmon says that you should like the video. If you don't, the world may end! Ah! Unlit blessing? This is not a Raru's blessing. What? Raru, did you do some work with this place? Raru decorated this place. Look at this. Wow, Raru, I like what you've done with the place. Looks good. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, what, what, what is the... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I was just gonna say, what is the point? Why is it like this? What, what is the point of having all this here? This is why it was a troll. Now, Am I allowed to just use, I'm scared of taking fall damage, but I can't take fall damage, can I? No. Low gravity, no fall damage, no fall damage. No fall damage. Okay, I think we gotta go down here. <gasps> what? I just lit a fire inside of the Great Deku Tree. Do you think he can feel that? Not only is he dying to Gloomvin 19, but he also has heartburn right now. That sword, I sense a sacred power within it that is stronger than before. What has come to pass? You see, what happened was Zelda, time travel, dragon, secret stone, demon king? I think Raru forgot to pay the power bill. Okay, so this is a proving ground shine, which means we do need to kill all these guys, quick. Oh, jeez. You know what, what if I just do this? Am I gonna kill myself? Oh my gosh, no I didn't. I need to be a bit more careful. Ow, oh, jeez, he's blinding me. My eyes. Oh, they're all here. For all his boyfriend. <laughs> Watch this. This is what thinking with our brain does. If we use our brain and we think, we can do crazy things, guys. Normally, I never think with my brain. I think with my toes. But thinking with our brain. Endless possibilities. Shout out to the theme song to Sonic Unleashed. All right, you an essay about milk bottles? What would even an essay about mi milk bottles be? <laughs> the classic milk bottle. Where does it originate from? And why do we use it? Find out in this essay. You see, the classic glass milk bottle originated in the 1800s, back when Sir 
Isaac Newton invented gravity. You see, carpet originated from the Egyptians. The Egyptians created the first carpet because there was too much sand everywhere. Portable pots breaks rocks, really? Who knew? Pot was the answer to everything. Oh, I guess Snoop Dogg knew. Play po- Ah! Pokemon XYZ. Ah! What the- Will this make me even more front heavy? Will this fly? Will this take my battery life? Let's find out. Ah, yes. When your mom says it's time to take a shower, but you're busy playing video games, no more Stinky Link. Stinky Linky, no more. Now, you may be asking, Mr. Nice Guy, why don't you just go buy some more heat resistant armor? Spare change. Spare change, ma'am. Poor Shane, what have you been spending all your rupees on? Uh, drugs. Speed run. Acorn. I'm really nuts about this maze we're in. <laughs> Hug Mr. Mean Guy. I'm sure he appreciates it. Maybe he won't be mean after anymore after he experiences the bliss that is a hug. Nope. Still mean. From high above to far below. Prove your courage by diving into the depths of the earth, 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 earth. The final way shall open up to you, 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 you. Why is there so much echo, dude? Oh yes, guys, remember the Yiga clan is just the Australian Sheikah clan. Take a look at the Yiga clan symbol right there. Flip the image upside down. Do you see that? Now it's the Sheikah symbol. Whoa. The Yiga symbol is just the Sheikah symbol upside down. AKA the Australian version. Because everything's upside down in Australia. That's the joke. What in the whoa? Why are the glue bands here? I'm just here for bananas. The banana guardian is here. With all of those hands, I'm sure they could collect tons of bananas really quickly. Go, 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 go. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. Ah. All right. I think we're safe. Oh, whoa. Never mind. How did you come down a cliff? What? I was like, I think we're safe. And he literally was. About to grab my booty. Right, so you're a new customer, I think. Well, I don't do the dying around here. I do the living. I don't know if you should do the dying though. Like if, if you do the dying, isn't that like um illegal? Alright, I'm here to die. Hey sir, sir? Excuse me. Excuse me. Rude. My co-workers at this place. Not the nicest people so far. Hey, excuse me, sir, 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 <laughs> sir, ah, sir! All right, you forced me. You forced me to do it. Oh, I guess uh, he was the manager. What did we get? <gasps> we got the cross that they put Jesus on. Let's make the cross. All right, Master Koga died for our sins. I'm gonna get canceled by Christians now for uh, for making these type of jokes, am I? Are people gonna get mad at me like they got mad at Lil Nas X? Hey, you, sir. Uh, I just want to talk to you. Uh, have you uh, considered Master Koga as your Lord and Savior? No? Then die. Oh, thanks for for the ride. Is this what you do all day? Just drive around in circles aimlessly? until uh, Master Koga eventually rewards you with a new supply of bananas. Are you tweaking? Look at him, he's shaking. You see this? I think he's got, he, I think he had a little bit too much bananas. I think his uh, potassium intake is a little too high. Is it true that I heard that if you eat a certain amount of bananas in like one day, that it's like really bad for you because you get like too much potassium? Bananas or other high potassium foods can cause excess potassium in the body, also called hyperkalemia. This can cause serious health problems, including heart issues. Oh no. Sticking to one to two bananas per day shouldn't cause issues for most people. Oh no. With that said, <laughs> remember that they are relatively high in carbohydrates, so eating them along with protein or fat is also advisable to support stable energy levels. No, I can't I can't eat anything else besides bananas, Google. I, oh no. Guys, I think we've had too much potassium today. I think I might die. We're going down! No worry guys, this is an all terrain vehicle, the Yiga the Yiga uh, mechanics and engineers, uh, they know how to make the greatest car known to man. Elon Musk's cyber truck ain't got nothing on the Yiga truck. The Yiga truck is the ultimate all-terrain vehicle. All the terrains. Which terrains, you may ask? 
all of them, I will cook up the greatest Yiga Clan invention of all time. This is going to become a future Yiga schematic in the next Zelda game. It's gonna be like Shark Tank, right? Where these people who invent things, they come up to uh, some rich people and they'll see if they will fund their invention. Master Koga is the sharks. He is the shark who we are going to show our invention to. And he is going to possibly fund our new invention here that we're creating if he likes it. Um, actually, I've got a bad feeling about this. The second we get on the steering stick, I think the cannons are gonna shoot the ground and blow us up. Screw it, for science! Ah! <laughs> oh. oh, it's working. It's working. It's very barely, very barely. We're gonna run out of battery already. Oh no. <laughs> ah! You're going down, look out landing. Leave Ganondorf alone. Uh, uh, hey guys, what's up? Didn't see you there. Um, totally wasn't trying to take down the lookout landing or anything like that. I totally don't work for the Yiga Clan, guys. Um, all right. Where's Pura? She's the leader of this place, right? We gotta take her down. There she is, get her! What? Uh, hi Pura. Oh, oh no, we're in it. Oh no, this is bad. Uh, we're going backwards. We're going back. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Dang it! Die! Glory to Master Koga! Master Koga was nicer to me than you! I think he, Master Koga had his heart broken because look at him. He just looks sad and depressed. He looks like N in that one scene in Xenoblade 3. How did he get there if the entrance in the depths was cut off and he had to go to the surface? Whoa, Shammy. Shammy found a plot hole. He can never leave the depths, right? How did you get in here? Master Koga clearly knows how to teleport. He is the Almighty. He can do anything. He is our Lord and Savior, Master Koga. Do not question his abilities again, Shammy. SMH. Thoughts on Ariana Grande? Um, her name sounds like a drink at Starbucks. Glory to Master Koga and the mighty Yiga clan. Our master is the strongest. He's got a secret plan. His fall from sand to darkness did not bring him to the depths, but did he waver? Never. He into action leapt. The Yiga clan that followed, hearts firing true, will soon raise up our weapon, revived by the stone of blue. In the dark we dwell now, we covered the clumps of earth. Soon we'll rise to take high rule for everything it's worth. Glory to Master Koga and the mighty Yiga clan. The earth itself will tremble, our ascension is at hand. Glory to Master Koga. Put MatPat in my finale. I don't know what MatPat has anything to do with my YouTube channel. But yeah, man, I'll, I'll go, uh, I'm gonna hit MatPat up right now in the DMs. Actually, you know what, I'll just, I'll just call him, actually. Oh, hey, MatPat, um, nice to talk to you again. I know we're like best buds and we hang out all the time and I just talked to you actually last night, but, uh, cause we're buddies like that and we're super chill and everything like that. It's not like we've never talked to each other before, but I was wondering if you wanted to, uh, collab for my Tears of Kingdom finale. <laughs> Bro, what the heck? I can't say that, dude. What is wrong with that guy? That was easy. You know, I may have curse controls, but I still have five guys on my team, five guys. Shout out to the restaurant, five guys. This reminds me of that one time I ate five guys. And then I went out to dinner with them afterwards. Wait, what? You need to drink more water, Evan? That's <laughs> Aiden's over here telling people to force me to drink more water. I think, honestly, Aiden isn't even concerned about my hydration habits. I think she just wants me to go pee. I saved my points for this exact moment. The best way to use your points is by torturing Streamer Man himself. I mean, how do we know you're actually drinking? You're hiding behind the screen. I did, okay? Are you happy? Aiden redeemed another hydration break. We're never gonna get anything done anymore. Odd redeemed another one? Oh my god. Mr. Nice Guy drinks water, the stream. See, now you're gonna complain about we can't tell if you're actually drinking the water. It looks like you are, but maybe you're not drinking it. You're faking it. See, how do I, how do I prove this to you guys? 
Uh, is that proof enough? We're fine, guys. I still don't have to go use the bathroom. Clearly, the rumors of my bladder being small were greatly exaggerated. What if this entire time I was actually lying about having to take a pee break? It was just a running joke, me trolling you the entire time. Hmm. You guys do know that overhydrating is also not healthy for you. Yeah, I think you guys are trying to get me killed. Got water all over myself now, and it's cold. Actually, I work in a hospital, and you need to drink a lot for it to become an issue. So drink up. How many people who watch me work at a hospital? Any other nurses in the chat? Because I'm gonna need them when I die from all the water. All right, did somebody uh redeem a hydration break? Who did it? Who did it? Who is getting banned? Ooh, odd. You know what? I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to time you out for that one, odd. Hydration breaks now result in a timeout. <laughs> I stand up for my comrades. Aiden redeemed a hydration break. You said I couldn't time you out, Aiden. Because you're a mod. You think you are safe from my powers? You don't understand my abilities. Five minute timeout. Oh, wait. What's this, guys? Excuse me? <laughs> uh, who is this? It's you. <laughs> uh, you are sleeping on the couch tonight. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> I don't believe I know what this who this is. Um, this, I got a I got a scam call, guys, real quick. Um, okay, drink up, drink up, Buttercup. Okay, um, guys, um, you win. I gotta pee. Oh, this has to be something good. Please, please tell me this is the armor I need. Ah. Oh. So close! It's the soldier's helm. This helmet has zero drip. The drip levels are off the chart, but in the negative direction. I can't fight Ganondorf with a mop on my head. Yo, look at Link's got some thigh squish. You see that? Link's got the thick thighs. Didn't know he had, were thicked up like that. This is why I can never be stealthy in this game, because the loud clap of Link's thighs keep alerting the guards. Oh. Ah! Uh, what are you doing? But why are you telling me to close my eyes? I do not consent to this. Oh, 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 pee, you, your breath stinks. Oh my god. Oh, oh. My. My. Brush your teeth while you're down there. The light dragon. If I find this dragon, it will surely light up my day. Aha. We have visual. Pursuit suspect. She's wanted for. Hoarding her scales. We want Zelda's body parts. Hey, women are good for more than just their bodies there, odd. SMH. The library sounded like the guarding theme. It does have a, that same kind of piano. This is how you know Breath of the Wild players have been traumatized. They hear pianos and they instantly get scared that the guardian's nearby. Just listen to some music casually on the radio and all of a sudden piano starts playing in the song you listen to and all of a sudden you're like, <gasps> Oh gosh, Guardians! Nintendo has traumatized us. We are victims. Look at him go, <laughs> it's like frozen. I think if we're too far away from him, he just might not move. Wow, that is a cool ability you got there, Bobby. Go in what? No, Bobby! In the arms of the angel. Okay, now we have to Figure out how we're going to get Bobby up. Cool hat, thanks. This is, oh wait, I forgot the hat. Look at this. See that? That's how we get up to the top. Let's go. Last time I dropped Bobby, he disappeared. So let's hope he doesn't disappear this time. Let's go. Let's go Bobby, to the final fight. What Bobby, why did you do that to me? <laughs> what the heck was that? He killed me and I have no help for the final fight. You betrayed me. Are you working for Ganondorf? Is that what this is? Mr. Mean Guy told me to do it. Hey. Oh, Neil. Good idea. Neil says, I think you can cook now. Let's try that out. Hello and welcome back to Cooking with Mr. Nice Guy. Today I'll be teaching you how to make an English muffin with peanut butter. So, what you're gonna need to do is... This, this, that, this, that, that, this, and we're done. 
thanks for watching today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to check out my other videos. My name is Mr. Nice Guy, and I will talk to you later. Shoutouts to Ashen, Elster, Elson, Arrow, Mad World, Ashwood S, Jemmy, Redscape, Happy Saturday, Nintendo Boy, Goalie, Odd, Sarah, Finn, Quinn, Game Planet, Great Gaming Game, Tristan, Dark Noodle, Plug, Melissa, Aiden, Sunny Dave, Brooke, and Lord for Superman on Patreon, or being a member on my channel.